Bad Wolf here, and for today's deck tech, I have a budget tiny leader or red white heroic deck. And instead of going over all 50 cards, I'm just going to focus on my top five favorite cards in it because it's just your basic red white heroic deck. You have spells to target and creatures to hit with it. So, yes, I figured let's focus on the top five favorite cards because those are what I'm most excited to talk about. But the tiny leader for this deck is Annex and Siamy. For three mana, one colorless, a red and a white, you get a 3-2 first strike vigilant creature with heroic ability of whenever a spell targets it, creatures you control get plus one plus one and gain trample until end of turn. Yes, so awesome, seriously. Trampling is way, way important. And that plus one plus one buffing your entire uh, army is awesome. Like seriously, just awesome. I really like this for a tiny leader and it's really, really inexpensive to get and pick up and it's a lot of fun to build around. I really like red, white aggro decks and this is just the perfect tiny leader for that. Number five, favorite hoplite. One white mana for a one, two creature. Its heroic ability is when you target it, you get to put a plus one, plus one counter on it and prevent all damage that would be dealt to it this turn. You get to basically negate something by pumping it, which is awesome and so much fun. I love playing with this card. Whenever I build any type of heroic deck, I'm usually including foras of this guy because just being able to cast a spell, make it bigger, and prevent all damage that would be dealt to it is just awesome like seriously so awesome that's why it's just good card number four is madcap skills two mana one colorless and a red to give a target creatures enchantment plus three plus oh Ugh, that's i like it when they're big numbers like plus three plus oh it's just, just nice to have big numbers on that and because that's the important part, especially when you have things like trampling with Annex and Siamine, which you want to do a lot. It just makes it so much better. It also has the ability that that creature that it's on can't be blocked except by two or more creatures. <laughs> so basically, you're going to kill two things, and if they only have one creature out, that sucks to be them because they can't block it. It's awesome and a lot of fun to play with. Card number three is Teamer Battle Rage. Two mana, one colorless, and a red for another enchant or an instant spell that gives target creature double strike until end of turn. This is disgustingly beautiful. Double strike is awesome. It also has a ferocious ability. So if you have a creature four or greater, then that creature that it's you're targeting also gets trample. As if it's not enough, you know, double strike and trample is just ridiculously, ridiculously good. Oh, so much. This card is fun to just blow out your opponent with and kill them really quickly because they didn't see it coming. So hot of them, you know, it's awesome. Card number two is a Johnny's a presence. One white mana to give target creature plus one plus one until end of turn and it gains indestructibility until end of turn as well. So basically you get to counter whatever spell they're trying to get rid of your creature with, give it plus one plus one and trigger heroic. Plus, what's awesome about this card is if you're flooding out and have a ton of mana, you can strive with it. It just costs three, three extra mana, two colorless and a white per creature you want to target. But if you're flooding out and have a ton of mana that you don't have anything else to do with, rip this off of the top. You can pump your entire team, give it all indestructibility, trigger all their heroics, and just make them bigger and swing and kill with them. It's just, it's just an awesome card, especially with that indestructibility on there. Oh, so much fun. It doesn't work against exile, but still, indestructibility is awesome. And my top favorite card in this deck is Boros Charm. I don't know why, but I love this card. One red mana, one white mana for three different things that you can choose. You can either make all your permanents indestructible this turn, which is fantastic. You can target a creature and give a double strike, which is also fantastic fantastic in this deck seriously triggering heroic giving double strike it's just ridiculous ridiculous and its third and final ability is you can punch your opponent in the face for four it's like this card does everything you could ever want it to in this type of deck and it's like just not dead in your hand because either you're 
dealing damage to your opponent, you're giving something double strike and triggering heroic, or you're protecting all of your stuff from anything. It's awesome and amazing and it's my favorite card in this deck, like seriously. It's just so good. But let me know what you think of this deck in the comments below. I'll have a link to um, the full deck list there so you can go check it out. If you have any suggestions, also put that in the comments below. Like this video and subscribe for more.